Hi, I'm Jim Calari. I'm the editorial director of Plastics Technology Magazine. I'm excited to let you know that our extrusion conference is coming up September 21st to the 23rd in Rosemont, Illinois at the Donald Stevens Convention Center. Our conference is going to be set up as we have been setting up our program since 2015. We have general extrusion sessions in the morning and we have afternoon sessions that drill down to specific extrusion technologies, film and sheet, pipe profile and tubing, and compounding. We have a new twist this year. We have a co-location with our friends from Tappy on film extrusion in a circular economy. Uh, with us today is Rory Wolf. Rory is the business unit manager for ITW Pillar Technologies, and he's also involved with Tappy. So, Rory, can you fill us in on what your programming is about? Maybe first talk a little bit about Tappy and, Tapp and what Tappy does. I'm glad to do that. Thanks for the intro. Tappy is a 14,000 member strong international uh, non governmental organization. It's a, it's a trade association with members ranging from engineers to scientists to managers, academics, all in the area of either pulp paper or plastics or nanotechnologies, pretty diverse uh, group of um, divisions within TAPI. Now they'll touch on flexible packaging, which is uh, the division that I'm a part of, lamination, adhesives, coatings, extrusions, all the like. They've been around for uh, many years and a uh, very strong forum uh, of professionals that come to support uh, the industry and, and uh, work through TAPI to do that. Right. Now, Rory, you put together the symposium, and the symposium, I'd like to point out, will be held the afternoon before our conference. So that's the afternoon of September 20th. And uh, we talked about this a lot. Uh, before you got to putting it together, and we settled on a a, a, a afternoon program uh, focused on sustainability. So, could you elaborate a little bit on some of the things that uh, attendees are going to hear about? Yeah. So, so you mentioned it. the The title of the program is "Film Processing and Coding in a Circular Economy," and the program is going to specifically address what is needed to be talked about today and and exactly what that circular economy represents. And, and that's a framework approach that everyone in the world is trying to get their arms around that uh, aims to rethink the, the traditional uh, linear production uh, and consumption model, which basically we all know it as you, you take it, you make it, and then you dispose of it. So this discussion that's gonna take place at the symposium is, is going to aim to closing uh, the loop on materials and resources. Uh, we're going to have a leading expert uh, group uh, in this symposium that's going to help all the attendees understand, you know, how we're going to be able to create these new pathways towards circularity. Yeah. You know, I think the symposium at our conference fit very well together because our conference, the film extrusion tracks that we have on the afternoons, really focus on the nuts and bolts of the technology, problem solving, troubleshooting new technologies whereas yours kind of takes takes it at a at a at a higher level looking at something an issue that is is critically important to the film processing community but doesn't really quite fit into what i would consider a technical conference don't you agree i would agree with that yeah that's exactly right you know we're going to be looking at uh, a lot of ways for attendees to look at uh, sustainability in a holistic way and how we can all work together to uh, modify the supply chain and uh, also the designs uh, that are coming to market so that we can increase uh, sustainability and recyclability. Right. So I think it's good for the core attendee to the extrusion conference to attend the symposium because they could be plant level management people, they could be company presidents, and sustainability is something that's going to become part of their everyday vernacular, because this is this and the circular economy are two issues that um, are not going to just magically disappear. Right. And everyone within the organization, from, as you said, the CEO down to uh, plant management and maybe even beyond that, uh, need to be involved in those solutions. Right. And obviously, those who register for your conference will have the opportunity to attend the extrusion conference and walk the exhibit hall and network. So uh, there's a, a, a lot of opportunities 
for folks who, uh, who attend both of our events. Yeah, I agree. The bundling opportunity that, uh, that's been offered by the Extrusion Conference to everyone involved in symposium is, is going to be a, a great benefit. Right, right. Yeah, actually, we have an option to purchase a 10% discounted package for those who want to attend both Extrusion and TAPI. So um, in summary, uh, you could go to extrusionconference.com for all of the registration information. Uh, the TAPI Symposium that Rory and I have been talking about is on the afternoon of September 20th. And then our conference kicks in from the 21st to the 23rd. Thanks, Rory. I appreciate your time. And uh, we'll see you in Chicago. We'll see you then. Thanks, Joe. Thanks.